guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do a project plan finale and I can't believe it's already here. We have been doing this project for six months and that is absolutely insane. This past half year has gone by so fast and so much have happened. <laughs> yeah, this is this is me project pan. It is based around the greatest showman movie and it is created by the lovely Jessica. And you guys know her if you follow me because I collab with her um, all the time and most of the ladies actually in here I collab with all the time. But yes, we were supposed to pick 10 items related to the movie or just ourselves. So I tried to link to the movie as well as I could. I have one, two, three, four, five, six items left. I don't remember if I finished any since last update. I don't think I did. I think I decluttered some and realized that I didn't, I couldn't finish any more product in this project. Let me show you guys the six items that I have here to show you. And I think I'm, yeah, I'm going to declutter two items just because I don't want to use them anymore. They are old and yeah, I just don't want to use them anymore. Three items, three items. The first one that I'm going to declutter is my lip gloss from Gosh. I have been working on this for years and it's still not gone. And I told myself, I, this is the last chance. This is going to go after this project is done. I started, and still I am, at that big black nail polish line. I try to swirl around and I'm just below the line. I have been using it quite a lot lately because I really wanted to get some good use out of it until or before this finale. It's not, it's not gone, it hasn't gone bad because it, it still smells nice but and and the consistency is still there and everything but I don't like the stain because it is a hot pink. I'm not the biggest fan of hot pink stains. Um, it is a great lip gloss overall, but I'm just so tired of it. And I, I'm not a lip gloss person. I'm a lip lipstick person, to be honest. And if I am going to wear a lip gloss, it is going to be the butter glosses from NYX that I am wearing right now because they are just really amazing formula. So this is so old, so this is going to go. You can see the wear here. I try to swirl around, it is just below. The next one that I'm going to declutter is this NYX Vivid Bright eyeliner that I have in the product. I used up the purple one and then I decluttered the um, blue one last time because it was crumbly and dry and I haven't used it enough to call it done. So I decluttered that one and now this is just going to go. It's just as old as the other two so this is going to go like next month or the month after. I'm pretty sure and I haven't used it enough to call it done but I am double dipping into this product when I need to do a winged liner or anything. Um, and it's just not a color for me. It's not vivid or anything. It's it's a fine green, but it's not the green that I want my liner to be, if that makes sense. So this is going to go. Um, yeah, I'm just not the biggest fan. Next item that I'm going to declutter, and that is solely based around it's an extra step in my routine or my lipstick applying routine or whatever. I don't need this step. And I have right here beside me a pile of makeup that I'm going to declutter. And that is the rest of my lip toppers. I don't use them enough. I have used this, I have used half of this lipstick in this project, which is really nice. But that took me half a year. And I don't have the time to do that with the rest of my lip toppers that I have in my collection. And I have a few. I have eight lipstick toppers and then I have four lip glosses with glitter. I am keeping two because I really like those, but these I don't, I don't like them. And if you think about it, that is a really long time to go through these lip glosses and lip toppers and they are not all this white pinky color. They are blue and green and no, not going to happen. So it's just going to 
go bye bye it is the w7 kiss and trip holographic lipstick if i didn't tell you guys and i have made really really nice progress on it yeah so i've kind of used half of the lipstick which i think is really nice i didn't have a goal when i put it in it just fitted really really nicely to the category or a, a scene in the movie um and it just made me realize something about myself and i don't have time for this anymore i don't like this step enough to keep it in this is not exciting i use it on and off now i use it more often than i did in the beginning of the the year now it is the w7 uh, glitter primer and um, yeah you can't see <laughs> what it is anymore but i'm a little bit below the marking now it, it's going slowly because it's a glitter primer and you don't need a lot this one is disappointing this is, this is this is my ebay lip liner and i was really really sure that i could finish this in like half a year even though it was a reddish more berry shade but i thought you can layer it that's fine i thought that with this one as well it's getting so small and you guys i can finish this in six months <laughs> The progress is not good, <laughs> but yeah. So here we are. I started up here. I have all of that left. So the last update, yeah, not that good. But it went down. I'm happy about it. And it is going back to my lip liner collection because I need a break from these because they are not my favorite lip liners. And I really need to have the motivation to go through some more lip liners before I work on it again. The last item that I have in this project is my W7 Night Light Highlighter, which I now call a corrector. So from now on, it's just a corrector. <laughs> I am using this every single day as my under eye corrector and I absolutely love it. It brightens my eyes in the right way. I don't like it as a regular highlighter because it's matte and it doesn't do anything for me. Not what I wanted to do at least. So I haven't had progress up till last update where I had the minimal amount of progress. And you guys, look where I am now. I'm finally making progress. I can't believe I needed to use it for like five months before I could see any progress. I'm really excited about it. And that gives me hope that I'm not going to have this in my routine for like five years. So. I'm excited and it's also on the it's not old old but it does have some years on it so it gotta go it gotta go but I really really enjoy it but I don't think you can get it anymore I don't know if I'm going to buy it again though because I don't know if I am I have to think about that but yes that is my last product in this update or finale project whatever you want to call it i'm really excited to wrap it up but because it has been so much fun but i'm doing so many projects right now it's actually really nice to have cut down some of the products in my collection but also the amount of pro products i am working on and projects overall jessica i have been enjoying this so much it has been so much fun and watching everyone's updates and everything i am so excited to watch the finales for the other girls i haven't watched them yet because i'm behind on watching videos at the moment but yeah if you haven't checked out the other ladies you should definitely do that i have them linked down below as well as the ones on instagram i'm really excited and i hope you guys enjoyed this small series and want to stick around if you're new here i do a lot of project planning as I just said, I have a lot going on. I hope you are going to look forward to the declutter that I'm making. Um, it's rather big. I do declutter on a month monthly basis, but this is bigger. Yeah, it just had to be done. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed and until my next one, please take care.